everyone, Monica, and welcome to Polish Mama Cooks. I got my first request, and it's for Żurek. Yum! A typical Polish soup served for Easter, which is great because Easter is right behind the corner. Making this recipe will definitely bring me home, so thank you for that. First, before we actually make the soup, we have to prepare something that is called zakwas. Zakwas is a soup starter based in this case on rye flour. You can buy it in a shop, Eastern European shop, but it's much better when you make it at home. So let me show you how I make mine. Zakvas is basically fermented flour. So mostly what you're gonna need is time. Besides that, you're gonna need a jar, some water, rye flour, and garlic. Basically for every tablespoon of rye flour, you need half a cup of water. So I will be making about half a liter of zakvas, which is enough for about two to two and a half liters of actual jurek. For that, I need five tablespoons of rye flour and I'm going to mix it with two cups, which is 500 milliliters of water. I can't forget about the garlic, so I peel it and then put it on a cutting board and with the side of my knife, I just crush it and then add it to the jar. I mix it all well. Finally, I cover it with a clean cloth and then hold it with a rubber band. I always use the rubber bands that were used to combine these powders. That way I don't have to buy them. Final ingredient that we need is thyme. So put it somewhere in room temperature in a pantry or on top of your fridge and mix it every single day. Day one, two, fruit five. Wow. I can smell the garlic, it just smells delicious. Remember, mix it every day for five days. Sour braised soup starter is crucial for Jurek. And it's so much better when you make it at home. As you can see, it's not hard to make. Please give me thumbs up if you like that movie. Leave me some comments as well. I will reply to them. If you want to see more tips and recipes from Polish Mama Cooks, please subscribe. Thank you and see you next time. Bye bye. Smacznego.